Hello class, this is section 3.1 and we are going to discuss linear second order ODEs with constant coefficients and by this we mean that we have no x anywhere in the equation so it's just ay double prime plus by plus cy equals zero I guess I should have included the word homogeneous here oh well, but we have this and uh, with a, b and c are constants So here's the tr there's a little trick involved here, and the trick is to express y in terms of an exponential. So we take y equals e raised to the rx for some uh, r constant, not not constant, so for, just for some r, okay? So y equals e to the rx, and see what happens. We plug that in, and we recall that y prime is going to be r e rx and y double prime is going to be r squared e r x. So this equation, this change of variables, will get us a r squared e r x plus b r e r x plus c e r x equals zero. But here's the thing. Remember that exponential functions are always non-zero. So this means that we can just divide out ERx without fear of any consequences. AR squared plus BR plus C equals zero. Alright, and um, this is going to be a, a pretty easy thing to solve. We have the quadratic formula to help us here. So we can write R equals minus b plus minus b squared minus 4ac over 2a. So we have two solutions, one plus and one minus. Call them r1 and r2. Okay. So it turns out that we then have y equals e r one x and y equals e r two x r two solutions to our differential equation. Are they linearly independent? And it's not obvious completely, but the answer is yes. And I'm not going to tell you why, but I'm, I am going to drop you a hint. Hint. Consider x equals 0 and x equals 1 and see what happens. But the fact is that these two solutions are going to be linearly independent and what happens then is that the general solution is going to be y equals c1 e r1x plus c2 e r2 x where c1 and c2 are our parameters and remember that r1 r2 solve r equals minus b plus minus b squared minus 4ac over 2a quadratic formula so this is the general solution. Let me clarify this a little bit of the differential equation a y double prime plus b y prime plus c y equals zero. <laughs> 